Red Bull have been routinely linked with Lando Norris throughout the 2023 season as Sergio Perez continues to struggle. Christian Horner has hinted that Red Bull could turn down the opportunity to bring Lando Norris into the team for 2025 and beyond, insisting that the team would like Sergio Perez's eventual replacement to come from within their driver pool. With Checo expected to depart Red Bull at the end of his current contract in 2024, Norris has been routinely touted as an option for the Milton Keynes-based team to explore. These conversations have intensified thanks to the Brits' immense performances this year. McLaren's poster boy has already stood on the podium four times this season, making more appearances in the top three than Charles Leclerc, Carlos Sainz and George Russell despite spending half of the campaign in midfield machinery. Asked about the potential of signing Norris for Red Bull, Horner told Sky Sports, Landos a great driver. H is a big talent, big personality and of course, H is one of those drivers that you keep an eye on. But there's many drivers that you keep an eye on as well. There's a generation of drivers out there at the moment that have got a huge amount of talent. Now, being Max's teammate is never going to be easy and some drivers may be up for that challenge, some may not be. But, of course, as well as the drivers we have in-house we keep an eye on all the driver market. As you can imagine, there's quite a bit of interest from certain sectors about driving a Red Bull car. Included in this interest is a host of drivers connected to the Red Bull program already. Daniel Ricciardo was brought back into a race seat with Alpha Tauri in order to both help the Fangia-based team develop the AT04 into 2024 and to put pressure on Checo for the second half of the season. Yuki Tsunoda will also be an option for Horner and Helmut Marko to consider. The Japanese driver has made noticeable steps forward in all three of his F1 seasons to date, and a fourth year with Alpha Tauri could see him become the polished academy product Red Bull are looking for. Max is operating at such a level that his confidence, his commitment, his talent is absolute at the moment and it's difficult to envisage somebody beating him in the same equipment, Horner continued. But there's some great talent out there and of course what we want is the best two drivers we can possibly field. So ideally that will come from within the talent pool that we have, and if we don't believe there's that capability we will look outside of that as to who's available.